to be another Halloween one! As you can tell, I am not my normal self. Today's video is gonna be some Halloween-like Snapchat filter makeup costume things. Obviously, they're not like scary costumes, but in case you just wanna wear like nice clothes and kind of do something cute with the face, then you can do this. I think the fawn is really cute if you're like better at makeup than I am because I was like this. <laughs> but I really hope you guys are excited to see this video. It took way longer to film than I expected. And yeah, I just hope you guys are excited and enjoying the Halloween series. And so I put my hair up so I got no makeup like in my hair and I started with like mascara, eyebrows, foundation etc but I didn't show that. So then I began by like contouring out my face with some purple eyeshadows as you can see now. I used it as like a contour and like damn it actually looked kind of cool from <laughs> the front. So then I obviously, I mean I personally wouldn't contour like this anymore but I put it like around my forehead and then cleaned it up with translucent powder. I mean you can see what I'm doing, I'm basically just warming up my face as you would with bronzer but instead with purple eyeshadow. I also put it around like my jawline and like down my neck and blended it all out. Then onto eyes I used the same colour and just used it in the crease again to add some like colour to my eyeshadow. I also used a few like more bluey toned purpley toned colours just to add more dimension to the actual shape of my face. Then above my eyebrow I started drawing these kind of flower like cross things. I tried to make them look more like flowers in a minute but basically these are supposed to be like the flowers you get above your head. <laughs> Although I did not do this very well, my pencil was so blunt. And then I did little black dots in the middle and black dots of eyeshadow and basically blended it out to make the flowers look more like dimensional. I mean, I'm not a makeup artist, so there's no way these are going to look amazing. And then I used an icy white highlighter. I then used a liquid lipstick and put some purple eyeshadow on top of it to make it more metallic. <laughs> So I started by taking this like orange eyeshadow and I realised it was not orange enough, it was way too brown toned but it was quite warm so that was good. Anyway, what am I going on about? I put this on my forehead and on my nose and then I also used it as a form of blush on my cheeks. I also overlaid a more orangey shade over the top so it actually looked more in quotation marks realistic <laughs> then i took a thick bl not black a thick white eyeliner and drew dots on my forehead and drew like a white patch around my nose area then with a black eyeliner i drew like a little nose thingy well it's a nose basically <laughs> and then i used a felt liner which this failed don't use any like information from this section I basically tried to do a double wing thing, like a second eyeliner wing, and it failed. It just went all so wrong. <laughs> and then I took some white sparkly like dazzle dust and I put that on top of the little dots because it didn't quite look like, bright enough and I put it on the inner corners of my eyes. Then I just took a nude lip because I thought it would be something more subtle. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe and comment any video requests that aren't Halloween related and are just like autumn related. Comment them right down below in the description, no, in the comment section so I can like do your recommendations and your requests. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing these makeup looks. Obviously, it's not like seriously scary, but it's just cute, you know? And so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you very soon with a new video. Bye, guys!